Introducing the two-stage S-Core, revolutionary two-stage collapsible core, mastering undercuts beyond 13%. Let's explore the challenges in releasing large undercuts. This small bottle part has an internal undercut of 16.2%, far exceeding the standard 13% limit that conventional single-stage collapsible cores can handle. Let's break down how the two-stage S-core operates. In the first stage, the core begins its partial collapse, releasing the primary section of the undercut. Next, in the second stage, the core completes its full collapse, allowing for the complete release of larger and deeper undercuts. Now, let's see the mold base operation in action. First, the first stage plates move, initiating the partial collapse of the core. Next, the second stage plates move, completing the core's full collapse. Finally, the stripper plate ejects the part from the mold, completing the cycle with precision and efficiency. This section view highlights the movements of the various segments within the collapsible core, showing how each component works together to achieve the core's function. Let's take a closer look at the GTSL latch lock. It functions as a guide bar on the outside and a three-stage latch lock on the inside, controlling the three stages of plate movement while guiding the moving plates. During the first stage, the latch bar holds all three plates together for the initial stroke. Next, the latch bar disengages from one plate, holding the remaining two plates together as they move to complete the second stroke. Finally, the stripper plate is released, allowing it to move independently and eject the part. Here, we see a full section view of the mold base, showcasing how the two-stage S-core is mounted across multiple plates. Each plate moves in a controlled sequence, with a designated stroke for each stage.